So this is our new Android 11 um, widescreen tablet for the Mercedes RSE sockets. So if you've got sockets in the back of the seats, uh, this will plug straight in. If it hasn't, we can install those sockets for you. This is based on an Android 11 uh, processor with 128 gig of memory and an 8 gig of RAM. So it's a very high spec unit. Um, this is the uh, boot up sequence. Just reminding you, uh, rear seat passengers, to wear their seat belts whilst it's doing its boot up mode. Um, and uh, once it's in, we'll run through some of its features. So this is the home screen. We can change this. There are various theme settings that we can change this through, but you've got um, internet browser, um, Google searching, etc. Um, we've also got uh, lots of apps. So we've got in there uh, Disney Plus. This is all preloaded. Um, YouTube, Netflix, um, various other bits and pieces in there as well. Play Store, where obviously you can load anything else you want. Um, it's also got um, audio output for cordless headphones, etc., an FM transmission where we can send the signals through to the radio at the front of the car, so whatever's going on the screen here can be listened to throughout the car. Um, so uh, very versatile. Um, sockets on the side for. Um, connecting various USB-C's, um, obviously adapters to um, USB normals, um, so you can plug in extra um, drives, etc. Um, runs in um, landscape mode as well as portrait, so we've got uh, a choice of whichever way we wanna view it. Um, so it's uh, quite a versatile device and a simple press for button underneath and unit pops out. This is the standard Mercedes fitment, but um, if it hasn't got that in the back of your seats, we can install. Um, so uh, yeah, that's the new Android 11 for Mercedes.